a winner so i want to do this quick video for you because when we're talking about business credit building one of the things i talk about a lot is having the commercial address or the business address right to help you look more fundable and credible on paper and this has been a big barrier for a lot of you new business owners and non new entrepreneurs because you guys don't have a commercial space or it may not even be needed for your business so a workaround that many of you are not considering is office sharing so guys in your local area whether it's atlanta philadelphia you know um you know chicago detroit wherever it is um the last couple of years a lot of places opened up office sharing and what the office sharing was basically is a space that you can rent out whether you're like a virtual person you need somewhere for um meetings or something to use part-time or some of them you could be a owner um at the actual space and it was where you would actually pay rent or like have like a lease right so some could be like 300 500 700 and 800 um dollars a month but you would have an actual commercial address so guys, that's what I'm walking into right now where mine is is immediate. Now, I actually have a commercial space. However, when COVID-19 happened, what happened? A bunch of people closed down their offices. So now people are paying $700, $800, $500 a month for this office sharing. They no longer need it. Well, a lot of the office sharing places actually started doing a mailbox service. And if you see right here, care consulting i'm here with all of the attorneys i've actually been here in a commercial space since 2017. um what the mail service is is it's a commercial location in your local area and instead of paying anywhere between 300 to 800 dollars a month for a commercial address and space, the mail service would allow you to just get your physical mail here, guys, for a much lower cost. Sometimes $50, sometimes $100, and you can have this address. It's a physical commercial location, guys, and you can actually get your mail here and you can use that. So it overcomes that barrier of building business credit for a much, much lower cost. So action item, guys. In your local area, just Google, you no know, office sharing for Detroit, office sharing for Atlanta, office sharing for wherever you're at, and look at the office sharing places. And then pick up the phone or look at their website and say to them, do you have a mail service, a commercial mail service? And what happens is, is a lot of times for like $50, $100, way lower amount, guys, you can actually get, look at this, your physical mail. And depending on the places, guys, you can have big mailboxes like this where you can get actual items. Ours actually has, oh, look at, see, I have boxes and stuff here, right? You see all the different names. Ours actually has um, an actual receptionist, and there's, see, there's a bunch of rooms and everything. So this is like the boardroom, because I would see clients and everything in here before, you know, COVID-19. And so this is still my office space um, because I'm actually um, have a lease here and I've had a lease here and I've kept it, but everybody has different needs. And so even when I do like workshops when I've done videos and I've done photo shoots, guys, I've come to this space, say I just need to work and I want to get out of my home office, right? <laughs> and I just want a different area. This is one of my favorite rooms right here. It's called the Innovation Room. And guys, I used to love, love, love working in this space, right? You see how beautiful it is? So and I, for my local clients, shout out to all my local Philadelphia clients because you guys remember seeing me in the office. You guys know that I would use this space right here a lot. This is the Innovation Room and I would meet with clients in person before COVID-19. But now if you need a commercial address and you don't want to pay a big, big amount, and mind you, like I said, we have a receptionist and everything. Like this is an amazing space. Um, they even had like a podcasting room. It was like amazing. Consultants use it in my actual office. The majority of the people are actually attorneys. So I want you to pay attention to that. Attorneys are very, very smart. Guess what? They don't see needing to pay $3,000, $5,000, $7,000 a month for commercial space when almost everything is virtual. And they may only need an actual space sometimes to see clients. Hello, guys. Success leaves clues. And what is the other thing? You see the consultation room, the bathrooms. So what is the other thing? This is a legitimate business expense. When you have an LLC, when you have a legitimate business and you have an expense like $100 a month for a commercial address to get your mail, guess what that is? A tax write-off. So you are building business credit, you have a physical commercial address, and at the end of the year, that $100 a month, you are writing off as a legitimate business expense. You see, Terry Kowser. 
Terry Calder. Now, I'm actually an owner here, so I still pay, you know, to have a commercial space. But guys, action item. Go to Google, look at office sharing for your location, for your area, for your zip code. Find out if they have a mail service if you do not want to have a virtual address, but you cannot afford a commercial address. And thank me in my DM. Have an amazing day, guys.